Train stations are often bustling hubs of activity, where travelers come and go, rushing to catch trains and buses to their destinations. But some train stations have a much more eerie and unsettling atmosphere, with ghostly apparitions and paranormal activity reported by those who dare to venture there. In this video, we will explore the top 10 most haunted train stations in the world, each with its own unique and spine-tingling stories of supernatural encounters. From the phantom footsteps of Victorian-era passengers to the ghostly apparitions of train conductors long gone, these train stations are sure to give you chills and make you think twice before catching your next train. So buckle up, as we take a spine-chilling journey through the world's most haunted train stations. Number 10. Waterfront Station, in Canada Located in Gastown, Vancouver, Waterfront Station is a railway station that was constructed in 1915 and is renowned for being one of the most haunted edifices in the city that still bustles with life. Recollective of a scene from the classic horror movie, The Shining, a security guard conducting rounds during the night shift recounted sighting a woman adorned in flapper-style clothing from the 1920s, swaying to music from the same era. As the guard inched closer to the woman, she vanished into thin air and the music abruptly ceased. On another occasion, the guard was confronted by the apparition of an elderly woman that glowed white and extended her hand towards him as he drew near. The guard fled the room in sheer terror. Additionally, instances of poltergeist activity were witnessed when a guard was petrified after several desks rearranged themselves to barricade his exit from a room. Understandably, he also made a hasty retreat from the scene. But that's not all. Visitors have also reported hearing phantom footsteps and glimpsing ghostly figures that walk along the tracks of this Union Station. Number 9. Glen Eden Railway Station in New Zealand Located in West Auckland, New Zealand, Glen Eden Railway Station is linked to a cemetery and was erected to cater to the needs of the Waikamete Cemetery. It was responsible for ferrying the deceased and their companions to the adjacent graveyard on Sundays. In 2001, the station underwent renovations that included the establishment of a new cafe. The staff members there have had several encounters with a ghostly figure whose backstory they are familiar with. Alec McFarlane, a railway worker, lost his life on January 11, 1924, at 3 p.m., when he was struck in the face by a mailbag hook hurled from a passing train. According to some reports, people have spotted McFarlane's apparition, who they describe as a man sporting a gray beard and wearing a trench coat. One employee encountered a man in a top hat, who vanished right before her eyes. Another worker has witnessed a spectral face peering through the window. Number 8. Pantuan's Metro Station in Mexico Situated on Line 2 of the railway system that serves Mexico City, Pantuan's Metro Station was inevitably going to be shrouded in tales of the supernatural, given its name, which translates to graveyards. This name is attributed to its close proximity to two ancient cemeteries, which, as we've seen from the earlier stories, is a recipe for ghostly encounters. Pantuan's metro station does not disappoint in this regard. In the tunnel that runs between Pantuan's and Tacuba stations, workers have reported hearing phantom knocking sounds emanating from the walls while navigating through the pitch-black tunnel. Additionally, they've spotted shadowy masses that vanish and reappear when they approach them. Given that the station's name is associated with places where the dead reside, it's hardly surprising that visitors would expect nothing less than paranormal activity. Number 7. Macquarie Fields Train Station, in Australia Located in the southwest of Sydney, New South Wales, Macquarie Fields is a suburban railway station that appears harmless to unsuspecting passers-by. However, after dark, the station takes on a more ominous character as the ghost of a teenage girl is said to haunt the deserted platform. Multiple witnesses have claimed to see the spectral figure pacing the station, her screams growing louder with each step. Dressed in her dance attire, the apparition clutches her blood-stained chest and emits mournful groans and moans. On occasion, the ghostly girl has been seen sitting motionless at the station, gazing blankly ahead with an unsettling expression on her face. Her presence has attracted the attention of Ghost Haunting Australia, who conducted an investigation of the station and captured photographic evidence of ectoplasmic manifestations and ghostly entities observing their activities. They intend to return to the site for further exploration. Number 6. Bishan MRT Station, in Singapore Numerous MRT, mass rapid transport stations in Singapore are rumored to be haunted, but Bishan MRT in central Singapore stands out as one of the most well-known. Built on the former Bishan Teng Cemetery, stories of paranormal activity began to circulate as soon as it opened its doors in 1987. Navina, another nearby station, was also constructed on a cemetery and soon became associated with stories of ghosts. 
One particularly chilling incident occurred in the early 1990s when a woman fainted after leaving the train and claimed that she had been groped by invisible hands. Maintenance staff have reported sightings of coffin bearers walking along the tracks, headless figures and phantom passengers near the station. Moreover, some have even heard footsteps on the roofs of moving trains. Number 5. Bagunkodor Train Station in India Are you enjoying the video so far? If so, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. This way you'll stay on top of all our releases and you'll also help us to keep producing videos. We are counting on you. Bagunkodor, a village located 161 miles from the West Bengal state capital of Calcutta, India, was abandoned for 42 years due to the ghostly sightings at the railway station. According to locals, a railway worker saw the ghost of a woman wearing a white sari who was thought to have been killed by a train. Her ghost would appear on the platform or wander the tracks, causing the worker's colleagues to flee the station. The railway station was finally reopened in 2009, and officials denied that the closure was due to the phantom. They attributed the closure to the narrow gauge rail that made it impossible for faster trains to run on it, and to stories fabricated by workers who disliked being based in such a remote area. There have been no recent reports of the lady in white haunting the station. Number 4. Brazil Central Station in Brazil on the return of trains to Brazil Central Station in the early hours of the morning, the flow of passengers disembarking at the stations does not correspond to the boardings. There is even the case of a train that left Santa Cruz completely empty, not stopping at any station. Upon arriving at Brazil Central Station, the doors were inexplicably activated, and ghosts dressed appropriately in the style of the 1920s and 1930s disembarked. Number 3. Kaobao Road Subway Station in China Line 1 of the Shanghai subway system is home to Kaobao Road Underground Station, which has a notorious and terrifying reputation. The station has seen nine mysterious deaths, unexplained train malfunctions, ghost sightings, and reports of commuters being pulled from the platform by an otherworldly force. Following a desperate act of death at the station, a girl in a red dress was spotted sitting on one of the platform seats for several days. In the darkness of the railway tracks, a woman's laughter has been heard at night when no one should be there. The most bone-chilling incident involves a commuter who fell off the platform. Witnesses claim that he did not slip or jump, but was pushed by an unseen entity. Due to these spine-tingling stories and its proximity to a mortuary, Kaobao Station has earned the nickname Ghost Station. Number 2. Connolly Station in Ireland During World War II, Connolly Station, the largest railway station in Ireland, located in Dublin, was damaged in a bomb attack on North Strand Road in 1941. Since then, there have been numerous sightings of spectral soldiers on the premises. Irish ghost hunters conducted a full investigation of the station, prompted by reports of a soldier in grey walking along a disused platform in 2011. In a video, there appears to be poltergeist activity that led to a door slamming shut. Additionally, a security guard reported seeing two figures in military gear on a camera, but they disappeared before he reached the area. Whether these incidents were caused by natural or supernatural forces is up for interpretation. Number 1. Union Station in Phoenix, USA The main train station in Phoenix, Arizona, known as Union Station, was once the city's primary transportation hub, but was surpassed by the airport in the 1950s. In 1995, Amtrak closed the station, and it has since been used occasionally for tourist trains and other events. Today, the building houses company offices, whose employees report sightings of a ghostly figure named Fred. According to the Arizona Republic newspaper, maintenance manager Dudley Weldon named the ghost Fred after the name randomly popped into his head. Several employees claim to have seen Fred running away from them, while others have felt a presence in the attic, a room that many refuse to enter as they believe it's where Fred resides. Additionally, there is a heavy door that opens and closes without explanation, leading some to speculate that Fred may be responsible. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel to watch more spooky videos. Thanks